All right, so in this video right here, Oscar Ramos, uh, he tries to give an explanation as to why AMP has been so quiet and flex as well. So in this question right here, and I'm gonna show you guys where you can find that question out for yourself, okay? Flexa has been unusually quiet. They haven't tweeted in a month and have, and AMP has, hasn't tweeted in a month. Why? Look at what time of year it is. The holiday shopping season kicks off on Black Friday. That's November 26th. This year, Flexa will be dropping a major retailer partnership bomb on us in the next week or two. Okay, well, that's cool and everything, but how Oscar tells it, he says, uh, usually when they're quiet, is something gigantic balling, okay? And I agree, last time it was the, the uh, biggest partnerships that they ever had, okay? But it's about implementation. So people are starting to talk about AMP again because this price went up a little bit for a couple months. It was under six cent and it was looking like it wasn't gonna move. All right, so the daily chart watchers, they were giving up on it and everything. I stopped talking about it because I got tired of people asking me when it was gonna move. All right, so over here, even AMP themselves have been quiet. This was their last post on their own Twitter feed, <clears throat> October 8th, as well as Flexa. And then you come over here to the group right here, just a couple days ago, this is one of the groups, just a couple days ago, somebody started posting again, but it was months before that. So this guy says, really, access fund is good for crypto investment? I don't even know what that is right now. But anyway, hi, friends, right time to buy more tokens. This was November 4th. So like I said, they're, they're just now starting to ask these questions because of what happened over here. I told you guys before, that is a bad way to try to a uh, cryptocurrency if it's a good investment or not, okay? Uh, somebody said it's about to drop back, okay? So like I said, no faith in AMP, man. No faith in AMP. All right, is it the right time to buy AMP? And then before that, it was July 15th. In this particular page, the other group is bigger, uh, but in this Facebook account, I'm not logged in. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, so like, yeah, it's, it might drop back below five cent, but what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna jump ship? I talked about this before, man. Uh, the best way to, you know, deal with AMP is to use, to use and to hold, to use and to hold, to have and to hold, right? All right, that's the best way to deal with the AMP silence.